What is up, guys? I'm Marco. Welcome back to Supernatural. This is episode 13, and uh, last episode was so much fun. Like, time travel stuff, and... Uh, Man, I'm just too smart for this world sometimes. I totally knew what was going on. I always know what's going on. Not always, but sometimes. And yeah, goodness. It was it was so much fun. It was so cool. And I'm, I'm I can't wait for, you know, for it to I don't know how it's going to continue, you know. Um It's going to be hard to be as awesome as it is with like so many characters missing, you know. But I think they were gonna find a way. Maybe they will introduce new characters or you know other stuff. But I really want to see how this whole storyline with the Leviathans continue, and I want to see. I want to see them just destroy that Richard. <laughs> I don't want to say his name now because that sounds weird. Um, let's go. Let's just do this. Is it gonna be? Is it gonna be? Throat slice, or is it gonna be stabby stab? <laughs> or is it gonna be thrown everywhere and stabby stab? Jesus Christ! Jeez, that's that's a big knife. I mean, that's it's gonna be slashy slash. Holy shit! Okay. Oh shit! I just saw that his hands were cut off. Holy crap! I was like. These wounds are really killing you, but yeah, it was the hands, the blood. Is that Bobby's? I don't know you kept that. Hey, I might sprung a leak. You know, most people would just carry a, a photo or something for a memento. Shut up, man. I'm, I'm, I'm honoring the guy, right? It's true. This is uh, grief therapy, kind of like you and your wild goose chase. Oh, I didn't see his. The latest, but Foot probably not the last. Well, they have a, a like a you symbol right there. Say. Samples were rejected. The genetic markers don't match anything we've ever seen. Didn't match any person in the database. No, I mean they don't match anything human. Ooh, that's interesting. I'll go undercover, go mingle amongst the locals, and uh, see what kind of clues bubble to the surface. You're going to a bar. Wow. If you want to oversimplify it. <laughs> Come on, Dane. Poor Sam. And he doesn't have help anymore. Nice suit, by the way. Guys don't dress that much. I like it. Yeah, well, it's a conservative line of work. What is these shots? What line is that? Look at these shots. They're so so up close and what the hell? Is it something with the eyes? She's 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 something. She's something. Arigato. <laughs> you speak Japanese? Uh enough to get by. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Look at you. Yeah, look at me. That's so good. I don't know. But she said, look at me. And he didn't look. And she was like, shit, he didn't look at me. You know? And, huh? What is happening? The shots and everything. I don't think that's good, Dean. She has the crazy eyes. Don't do it. Love the music, but it's gonna be copyrighted, so fuck. Yeah, he's having sex, he's getting killed. Is that what's gonna happen? <laughs> I love this. It's so well shot. What is, what, but something is wrong with her. Something is wrong with her, I swear. Guys, this is Charlene Penn, she's the lead on the case. More of the same. Uh, no first entry thrown across the room, made to suffer. His wife wasn't real happy with him. What was that? A few nights ago, he has a little mm. one-night fling. Anne found out, took off. But she would never do anything like... Yeah, of course. Okay. Thanks. Okay. That was this woman. This woman was it that Dean slept with. Lydia. Hey, it's uh, Dean from last night. Uh-huh. Uh, listen, I think I left something over at your place. Uh, it was an old flask. Uh, have you seen it? No. Wait, what? What is happening? Was well, she's pregnant? What? Not from Dean, though, right? <laughs> oh, 
Okay, this is strange. This is so strange. Damn it, why isn't she called? Who, uh, Lydia? <laughs> Wait, so some girl's actually dumping you the morning after? I think you're enjoying this a little more than you need to. Screw it, I'm going over there getting the flask. Didn't tell me you had a little girl? There's probably all kinds of things we didn't tell each other. Well, I hear they grow like weeds. You have no idea. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. This is so strange, honestly. I what the hell is happening? Another room. Shh. Who is that? You there? Shh. Don't talk. We'll discuss it later. Hello. What? I'm going back. So so they are like one night stands, and then they get then they get pregnant, and then their kid grows up super quick and kills someone? Is that it? But is that Dean's kid then? Cause that would that would be crazy. Emma, hurry up. Come on, Emma, it's time to go. Jesus Christ. Man, that's fucked up. Holy crap. Bye, Emma. Is is I mean this screams witches again. And I hate it. This morning, Emma was a baby. By sunset, she's Hannah Montana. <laughs> early years. <laughs> Very early, yeah. This is a tribute to the one who created and protects us. We hunt for her. What? We kill for her. And now we consume that kill as a symbol of unity with those who have completed their blood missions and furthered the life of the tribe. It's a variation of a symbol associated with the Greek pantheon, the temple of the goddess Harmonia. According to myth, said the coupling of Harmonia and Ares, the god of war, produced the Amazons. The Amazons? Like Wonder Woman? No, like, like a tribe of warriors. They actually existed. The comic books, they're just silly perversions. I've been digging for hours. And one thing's for sure, they ain't FBI. And who are they? They're after us, is what they are. Remember that cross-country murder spree those crazy brothers went on a couple months ago? That's them. It barely scratches the surface. They became more than human. Harmonia turned them into monsters. Can you kill them like humans? Or is this some kind of trick? Uh, doesn't say. No idea. I guess it could go either way. Well, that's helpful. Babies grew incredibly fast. Then the aging process became normal. Oh, shit. Is he going to realize it's her? It's his daughter? Kind of? Wow. So maybe you're, you're, uh... Don't say it. <laughs> Look, if that kid's yours... I said don't say it. Fine, I won't. Yeah, it Repeat. is. Dude, seriously, a one-night stand, you're just gonna roll the dice, you don't even... Of course not. Sam, what do you think, I'm brain dead? Okay, great. So it's not witches, it's a goddess again. Oh, man, the poor children. Jesus Christ. Sam? Yeah, these papers just moved. What? I didn't touch him. What? Wait, what? These papers moved? Are you kidding me? Wait, is that Bobby? Because of the flask? Didn't he go? Oh my god, I swear to god. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Please. Concentrate on something else. Why? Because it's not Bobby. Could be. No, it couldn't be. Why not? Because we want it to be. I need your help. I think I'm in trouble and you're the only person I can trust. Why? Because you're my father. No, no, I hate this, I hate this so much. Hell no. My mother threw me into that place and my father, well. No, oh, that's horrible. You get this is my last chance to have anything normal ever, right? I said it, this, these poor children, I mean, holy crap. It's not the women who do the killing. Instead, a ritual of initiation requires that the child born of the mating process must kill her own father. Yeah, there you go. What? I mean, I knew that. There you go, Sam. Of course she's evil. But why is she evil? I have to kill you. Is that what they told you? It's what I am. Well, then I should just kill you right now. Sure. 
But you could have done that 30 seconds ago. Why not just not kill anyone? Don't kill her. She doesn't kill you. I mean, she's only like three days old, but... Poor girl, I swear to God. I mean, this this is kind of like the same situation with, uh, like this 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 friend of, of Sam's and Dean killing her, right? And she was not about to be good, you know. So it's kind of the same situation there. So I can't blame Sam either here, you know. But fuck, that's so fucked up. Like, poor girl. I mean, she she doesn't have a choice, right? She she's been thrown in there grown up in three days doesn't even know anything about anything yet and the only thing that she's learned is that she has to kill her father and in that case it's dean and holy crap that's what what kind of an episode who thinks of this episode i mean fuck. holy crap that's so fucked up what did you say about amy you kill the monster i was going to oh the hell you were you think i'm an idiot you think i am dean you were gonna let her walk no i wasn't that's ridiculous Look, man, she was not yours. Not really. I, I said it. It's the same situation. It's the same situation. And yes, Dean, in that matter, probably wouldn't have done it, right? Or maybe he would. We don't know it. I can understand Sam's frustration here, but honestly, I'm... I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It, it's hard because, like, maybe Dean would have done it. I think Dean wouldn't have just let it happen. But at the same time, it's so fucked up, this whole situation, because of how this, this girl, <laughs> who didn't know anything about anything, the only thing that she knew it was like, okay, I have to do this. So, ah. Oh. Your head's not in it, man. When Cass died, you were wobbly, but now... Now that what? Oh, what, you're dealing with it so perfect? Yeah, newsflash, pal. You're just as screwed up as I am. You're just bigger. What? I don't know. <laughs> It almost got you killed. Now, I don't care how you deal. I really, really don't. But just don't, don't get killed. <laughs> yeah, true. What is this whole situation with, with the, the paper moving? We're not going to find out about it. Uh, that was Bobby. I'm 100% sure. But why didn't he leave? Why, did, why is it? Why? Does he still want to help the boys? Even in his afterlife? That's crazy. I mean, that's what I would like... That's what I really want. That's Bobby. That's just Bobby. I don't care if I'm in eternal torture here. I'm going to stay and help Sam and Dean still. Even if I'm dead. I'm going to learn how to do shit as a ghost. And then I'm going to travel with them with a flask. Because I know that Dean's going to take it. And then help them. That's Bobby. Freaking hell. That's awesome. That's fucking awesome. And fucked up. Because now he's going to be there forever, right? Unless someone, you know, releases him, burns the flask or something, I guess. I'm 100% sure that was him. Oh, God, I can't believe it, dude. I can't believe it. This was a fucked up episode. This poor child, these poor mothers, I have no idea what they're doing and why and what. It's uh, just, it's just so fucked up. I, I, I swear to God. I wish they wouldn't have had to do that, right? Dina actually had a kid here. <laughs> he actually had a kid. It was his kid. And Sam had to shoot it. Shoot her. It. I don't know. More it than her, I guess. Because she was a monster, kind of. Like, but not because she she chose. Because she had no choice. No, You know, she... She was never, never gonna be normal because she had three days to live and in all these three days she was trained to do this. So her whole life, this was all that she, she had to do and she was told to do. So who could, bl you could blame her? I mean, holy crap. So it's, it's fucked up that she has had to die, but as Dean said, monster's monster. And she was going to kill. So she had to die like Amy had to die
But yeah, whatever. It's because so many people told me uh, that he didn't kill the son of Amy because he didn't kill anyone yet. Well, she didn't kill anyone yet. She was about to, but she didn't. So, you know, I still don't blame her. Okay. Like, it's just like these, these arguments. They don't make any sense from a lot of people. So, so it's just like, what? They're just there to defend their favorite character. They don't go, like, on this, like, you know, I don't know. It doesn't matter. That was a great episode. Fucked up, but great. And uh, I can't wait to see the next one. Thank you so much for watching, and see you next time. Goodbye.